Hello, I'm Peter McKenna. I'm the chef owner of the Gannett restaurant in Glasgow. And um, today I'm going to knock up a dish using leftovers. It's Christmas time, our fridges are stocked. We're all guilty of it. We buy too much food. It's knowing what to do with it once Christmas has come and gone and it's Boxing Day. So at Christmas, I'm not a big fan of turkey. We're chefs, you know, we cook turkey the whole month of December. Well, usually not this year. I go for beef. So a bit of leftover beef, right? Cooked nicely, as you can see. And um, what are we gonna do with that? Boxing day in our household, we like to utilize whatever we have. So I've got celeriac. I've made a wee bit of remoulade. I'm not gonna go through the process of making a remoulade. You guys will know. Um, here we've got hen of the woods. So lightly cook them and put some Chardonnay vinegar onto them, a little bit of seasoning. Here we've got some pickle celeriac. It's just a straight 221 pickle. Um, some fried capers, a little bit of fried celeriac, some peeled walnuts, and because it's Christmas, I got some truffle. Don't usually get very much truffle in my household, but at Christmas, I always treat, treat the family. Okay, so what we're gonna start off with, right? Also, sorry, <laughs> important part of the dish. I've got some gentleman's relish. For those of you who don't know, gentleman's relish is um, it's a paste with anchovies, really, but we make it into a, a emulsion or like a mayonnaise, I suppose, using the anchovy instead of the egg. Okay, so got my beef. Like I said, I'm not gonna do any cooking. You know, this is leftovers. You don't need to be cooking the leftovers. So slice nice and fine. We're getting some amazing um, Scotch beef at the moment from our supplier McDuff's, all native breeds. And um, so I like to take a little bit home with me. Um, whenever I get the option. So thinly sliced, here we go. We start to build it. Got a ring, I like to keep everything nice and clean. Even when I'm at home, I like things to be neat and tidy. So you got your rim, you'll add straight in. Okay, you got the beef and not too fussy. Good quality ingredients, that's all, what it's all about, isn't it? Um, we're getting this incredible salt as well from the, the guys in Blackthorn, just out in the Ayrshire coast, so nice wee season on that. I take my pickle, and I'll overlap it slightly. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna cover it with the pickle. So you get the nice crunch and creaminess of the, the remoulade. You got the beautiful soft beef. And then you got nice, nice wee pickle. Nice contrast. There we go. Then we got the gentleman's relish. Nice and liberal with that. Tastes delicious. And on with the mushroom. Hen of the woods. They're beautiful. Um, kind of got a smoky flavor, I suppose. Um, I love using them here. And they're cultivated. Some capers. So this year has been one of ups and downs. Obviously the restaurant's been closed for quite a while. It's the same the whole way around the UK, I suppose. Then winning the, the chef of the year was quite a surprise. Quite welcomed. On with some, some nuts, some of the walnuts. And a wee bit of truffle. It's Christmas, why not? And there you go. Nice wee starter on Boxing Day. Leftover beef, some celeriac, walnut, a wee bit of gentleman's relish, and some truffle to cap it all off. Hope you enjoy.